Don't if you want. Okay. Start this uh, wonderful 116 star race. In five, four, three, two, one, go. I have a very strong reset, but it's fine. Okay. Mario. So we're going to start the, the run with a very different star than yesterday. With a secret star in a, a farm. Very cool star. As you can see in Grand Star, still like no fall damage here, no extra lives. And what was the third thing? You can exit the stage anytime if you make a mistake. You don't have to watch Mario's death animations or something, you can just instantly try again. Which is all, yeah. all cool. True. All cool features in this. I mean, some might consider no fall damage a bit lame, but I think it's actually a nice addition. You, you can use like more risky strats, like long jumping from uh, a cliff or stuff like that without taking damage, so it's fine. It's very I almost cool re-entered the old farm oh, again. Damn. Uh. Okay, let's go. Uh, So yeah, the, the world we call for this category is currently 148-42 by Red Slim, again. So it's currently have both 116 and 80 stars were recalled for this game. And Ludwig have better PB than me for this category as well. Yeah, PBing in this category, at least for me, is not super difficult because my PB has a deathless Course 15 and death is course 15 is not self explanatory. But yeah, it, it will be probably a close race like yesterday. Maybe not as close as, as yesterday, but it should be fine. <laughs> yesterday was crazy. Yeah. <laughs> it was everybody's race until Bowser. Like, if I didn't miss the third Bowser throw, I could have barely won against you, but. Bowser throws or Bowser throws? How much under estimate? Uh, the estimate is 225 because of one star you will see at the end. Because the star is like 4 minutes long. Something like that. So a death can cost a lot of time. But yeah, we should be good with estimate. We have like 25 to 30 minutes. Margin with the estimate. So you will see like all 80 coins star because yeah 80 coins not 100 coins. You will see like maybe the slowest 80 coins like this stage is probably one of the slowest. Stage 2. I don't think that. Yeah stage 2 is pretty slow. Yeah, if you if we get like both first try or second try the the star specifically. Well, uh, I would say maybe. Uh, I think course seven might be even slower. 
Core 7, 7 is... or Cores? Core 7 is Volcano, so it's not that bad. Oh no, I mean Cores 8 then. Cores oh, 8? Yeah. And what's the other slow one? Like Cores... Uh... 14? No, 14 is fine. No, 14 is good. Was 13? Thir 12? No, no 12 is it's fine as well. <laughs> I'm not remember remembering this. Oh, yeah, the... Um, like the... Course 11, I think it is. With like the... Um, yes. The Hibzo, the very strange stage. Although I think it's still faster than Course 8. Uh, yeah, probably. So this um, route has undergone some changes as well. This is with shoutouts to Merkenbach, who was with us yesterday. He rerouted uh, the 80 coin route here a little bit. Awesome that this game got uh, some attention. Like when I was starting running it, like nobody was really on the board, but like one guy for 116 stars, and that was it. And one from zero, I think, as well. And the one from, yeah, the Kongtastic for zero stars. But yeah, this is not like this is the the hardest stage will be course 15. You only saw one star from that yesterday, and you will see why this is like the hardest stage of the game later. This is the main reason why some people who want to do this game don't go for 116 at the beginning. It's because of this stage mainly. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, I was, was thinking I was missing something. Yeah, I was missing this red coin here. Okay, so that state was fine, I think, for me. Sage 2. I missed the red coin on behind, definitely. If you miss the red on the last loop, the only backup you can do is taking the box star and redo the red after that. You can't really backup with this slope is too steep. Can I just don't bonk on pipe please? And also you will see uh, some changes on some AD coins would because for some stage like the next stage set 4 you won't do the AD coin start with the first one but with reds because it's it's faster for 116 but it's faster to do the AD coin start with star 1 in AD star because we're not doing the reds at all so yeah this stage will be also a very slow Eddie coin. It's not the fastest one to do. Here we go. And will we also still have the um, the skip with the penguin on this stage? Not not very hard, but very painful if you missed it. Damn. Snowman.
time for the penguin skip for me. I hope it will go well. I'm entering it in a few seconds. I'm not sure. Oh my god. I missed it. Then I'm ahead now again until I die. <laughs> Yeah, this star is notorious for dying. Okay, I made it. Okay, that's fine. Here we go. I hide by two jumps. <laughs> Yeah, by like bouncing on the side there, you get a little bit of extra distance, so it makes it consistent, more consistent, yeah. more, much more easier to make it. Otherwise, like obviously, we don't want to walk, wait for this very slow penguin. I don't even know how much time it will take for the penguin to cross the the burning uh, section. I, I haven't even timed it because nah, it's just. There is no way. Pretty sure it's still faster. It would be a pain if this stuff was quicksand instead of yeah. ice lava, because then we had no other choice, basically. Us... Yeah, we could do these these quicksand ledge grab things. Yeah. But, uh... but it's pretty hard to do and very uh, long. Yeah, you, you can trap a jump um, uh, above, but it's like less easier, I would say. You can even cross with a good speed and double jump dive. Yeah, triple jump. The triple jump is what I first did, but that has the least consistency, at least for me. Because there you need to jump from the absolute edge. Yeah. The, pretty much the last pixel you're allowed to jump off without instantly taking lava damage. And like, if you're, if you're committed to the jump, like, you cannot even cancel it anymore, you're just dead. Okay, I did some routing mistakes here on the 80s, so you might be ahead again. I have too much speed, I missed the star for the, the, the spin one. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I I cannot get this like this trick with the spin drifts. Like when you do a rollout and you like I roll out and the stick. I just let the 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 stick not work to like conserve my speed. Like is that a st uh, a strat for some Kaizo ROM hack out there? Well, you have to get this bonus. I don't uh, know if there is... There is probably Kaizo acts like that. Thank you for the good luck, guys. Yeah, thank you very much. Wingcat, very... Super slow stage. Yeah, Wingcat is so slow, we... Can't, we can't even remotely include it in our 80 star route. Because the red coins are scattered all over the place here and we need to take several wing cap flights to collect them. Yeah, you, we need to take at least one box, I think. I just take two for safety, but I think one could be enough. I'm doing a slightly different stretch here than Darkman, I believe. I try to do this triple jump off the switch. This gives you barely enough height to make it here. So we have to collect this awful red coin later. 
pretty sure you don't need to do this um, to take this wing cap, but the other wing cap is slightly is on a bad spot there. To take a little detour to open that that one, and I don't think you can make it all the way to the next one. Will run out. That was pretty good reds on my side. My reds were also pretty good. Here we go. But now comes uh, also a challenge to make it up here again. This is also not self-explanatory. Okay, I mean. Stage five. One one more time. We are we are, we'll have to save and quit later to come back. But yeah, even if we don't have to come back here, we have to save and quit because of Koopa in the stage 13. Can you? Hello. Wow, it's ghosts sometimes, man. Yeah, just ground pound like four times. Like they, yeah. they get invisible like the last possible frame or some shit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's that you bounce on them and you lose like tons of time on these idiots here. here we go. Yeah, so um, you're not bound to only the two stars in this stage. It's just that, like, for convenience. Usually we just get the ADs with the reds. Yeah. So we have 20 stars to enter Bowser 1 fight. Because we have to come back later anyways. Because yet there's no way to skip the Vanish Cap box. And course 5, uh, I think... I don't know who, if I was Red Slim or another one, but... You found like BLG or stuff like that, but it's way too hard to do. He can't get like a lot of speed, so maybe someone doing tasks can get it, but yeah. So you're doing the entire stage first without like... Yeah. Plastic? Yeah, I'm doing it a little different here. I just get the 80s and the reds and I'm out of here. I mean, I'm pretty sure it like, doesn't change anything in terms of routing. Can you just... Can... One more star from me on stage 5 and then I'll go to Bowser. And after that we will see a second change about 80 coin stars in stage 1. We'll do 80 coins with red coins and not the box star. The so same thing as yesterday, we try to get the gate skip here, yeah. Dropped it too late, bomb exploded. But I have several tries to make it here. If I don't get it one try, I just don't respawn the bomb. I just go for another star and 
fight on the next, try it again on the next level entry. Yeah, the, the bomb on clip is very hard. Yeah, we need the biggest bomb available. Yeah, you need big bomb, you can do the trick with medium bombs or stuff like that. Time for attempt number two. Hope I don't have to do the change of cha of shame. You have like like six tries if you really want to do it. Okay, I work. Second try like yesterday. Yeah, I just finished Bowser, so I will do my first atom soon. Oh no, I'm, I'm not doing for stage 1 now? Okay, never mind. <laughs> already forgot my route, okay. I'm doing stage 1. What? Okay. Can you stop Mario, please? <laughs> okay. So I'm doing in overall 2 instead, okay, why not? Yeah, for the bomb clip, like, <laughs> everybody tries to give me advice on this. But I don't know how to do this bomb clip without the bomb exploding near you and you take damage. Like, Darkman and Malcolm Buck, they can all do this consistently. I just can't, can't do it. I guess I'm just too slow for some reason. Now, yesterday I forgot to open the cannon. Oh, rip. Before <laughs> trying to go for the cannon here, star here. Uh, I think I do, yes, sharp. I hold, I hold like backwards, and I jump like three times. Maybe I'm just holding the bomb too long in my hands in the first place. Like maybe I'm doing this this double jump too slow. I don't know. That's at least what makes what makes sense. So the 80 coin route here is a little bit different for me than for everybody else, I believe, because I'm going for some weird. Uh, wing cap fly it on the red coin near the chain chomp. The chain chomp's hitboxes are a little bit deceiving. They are much lower than they appear. It's actually possible to like um, fly with the wing cap on the red coin and not get hit by him. So what I try to do here is um, take off here. Okay, I got it, and now I need to... Okay. So this way I can grab this red coin over here. here we go. There's nothing interesting over there but the red coin, so... can cut off a few seconds by, the four, uh, by doing this. I have to hold back after the jumps, okay. I will try that la out later. It's for the advice, then. <laughs> okay, so yeah, we are doing very different route then. Yeah, we're doing <laughs> much different routing here. Yours might be just, just faster. Just didn't have time to like implement it. Yeah, we should have maybe tried to do the same route for the event. It should be better to follow. Oh 
my god, that was very close. It's possible to skip Hevzo completely, but it required very hard triple jump wall kick. With a very specific angle, so... Yesterday I got my little first, like, my little skip there. It saves like two seconds. Uh, we are not in different emulator, we are just using different graphic plugins, I think. That's because I think you are using Jabo, right? I think I'm using Jabo, yes, because ev everything else just tend to crash my emulator. And I am using, I think it's JLN64. Gliden or...? Not JLN. Yeah. I have Glide as well, but yeah, I'm using JLN right now. Because it was like the um, emulator tutorial for running the Vanilla game, and you have those plugins. Can you just please? Thank you. As you can see, Grand Star, the who made this uh, ROM hack. This is looking like like a verb, you know. Was a he is a big fan of. Uh, Okay, that is really bad now. Jaden Glide Gliden, it's looking like uh, like a verb, you know, like do it done and stuff like that. It's funny. Missing that red corner is the worst. Gluten 64, let's go. <laughs> it's almost looking like uh, a ROM hack name. Super Gluten 64. I have to take a detour again, like yesterday. Yesterday it was a different red coin I missed, though. Just died on 8 coin core 6. Uh oh. <laughs> Time for me to catch up, but I'm making my own mistakes here. <laughs> I probably can't really profit from them, time wise. Ramp on first. Hit this time. Very hard um, to, to make that. Again. Try again, like the uh, bully strat that I implemented. I have like practiced these strats so much. Still inconsistent, but I try to like lower him over here. That will not work. Well, I got I got the half strat there. The half strat is not that bad, but um, obviously what we want is we want to like hit him a total of three times, I believe, in a row, so he gets enough speed to just get pushed into the lava instantly, and we don't even have to come down for it to finish the job. But that's that's very hard to do. Like I don't I haven't really found a consistent setup for this yet.
Okay, I'll try to do double strats. I'm going to core 7 now. I think I got it. Yeah, I got it. Nice. That always feels good. <laughs> I got I just gold the star by 20 seconds. That's a lot. Yeah. As if you're uh, someone's best, it's not crazy enough already. Uh, not really, I haven't. It's uh, like a 148 right now. I haven't like run this category that much, so. I don't need to get an 80 star or the gold. Yeah, my my AD Sarsmo vest is way better than my 116. I still I like a lot of mistakes on this Sarsmo vest, like one death in Omnium, for example. And a lot of more stuff to do. Very good. Here we go. This is... The game is pretty easy. A part of like... One star maybe. <laughs> but yeah, it's a very fun game to run, so... If you guys want to try it, you can go ahead. We have made like some docks and stuff like that to to try to make the better route, the best route, sorry. So yeah, if you want like to run this game, feel free to ask. We can give you a maximum resource for that. At least for 80 star, for 116, we, I need to do more work on it. I'm just going to die. And the risky strategy in here. I just like die on a very easy star. That's shocking. Well, I like the strat, anyways. <laughs> like doing red coins for uh, last on blue fire volcano 80s. I die on the like the shell. The shell strat where you have to jump. Very stupid. I missed. Of course I missed. It's the most boring star in the game, I would say, because all you do here is milking the coins out of these thwomps or... Course 9, 80 eight coins? Yeah. <laughs> and pray they die on the ground pound, which sometimes just straight does not happen. Yeah, true. I don't know why that is. I don't know. If there, are, if there are specific spots on the backs of these guys which is straight up prevented. Or if it's some timing thing, I don't know. I don't know if it's just a, like a timing thing or... I have no idea. Here we go. Last one. Here we go. 
They behave. They behaved today. And now it's just literally just <laughs> swimming through this river for like 30 seconds. Collecting the rats. It's really not that exciting this time. Well, the red coins in this stage was part of the 80 star route for a little while. Yeah, I know it's... But only a very little while. Yeah, I know if like all those 80, ca 80 coins that we are doing in 80, it's no too slow. Now comes one of the stars I'm most afraid of because I hate timed boxes. I always tend to fail at those. Okay. I'm always relieved when I finish one of those stars. <laughs> Good luck, Kiroaki. Yeah, thank for the good luck, Kiroa. Also, this star we saw it yesterday already. This is somewhat scary, at least. If you're not that familiar with these kind of strats, but very easy to like mess this long jump up because the camera is tilted like in a 45 degree angle there, you can't really just hold up and let it happen. It's my time to do the right side of the canyon. That was not a bad course 9. If by Aglap Cam you mean the the one you can move slowly with the D-pad, yes, this Ag does have this D-pad camera movement. I don't really know if this is like the name of the, the cam or not. Here we go. Yeah, I just used, I don't know if you see that, but I like used the D-pad to move the camera slowly. This is not finished. Yeah, of course, it's, that happens. I so just, these boxes are super awful. I just tried to go to Bowser without finishing. And easily, nine. like, drop your, get your jump input on it dropped. Or a straight fall for the gap. Oh, what? Okay.
Again, like yesterday, we just lure Bowser over here. Pretty much the blindfolded strat. <laughs> yeah. There is like two strats for blindfolded. The one you, we like used without blindfolded and the second one it's just crazy. Like using the whoosh from Bowser to throw. You need it for the triple. Uh, for the last fight, right? I don't yeah, even see like, that much people using these strats. In play for Dynamine, of course. Yeah, this is Bowser 2 and Bowser 3. We are not seeing this case in Bowser 2 that much because uh, usually we like use this teleport thing instead of running. You need to be very far, far away from him to teleport. To to run, not teleport. Sorry. They missed to grab the Bowser tail, I don't know. I think in this stage, um, I'm the only one who will go for a risky strat on the red coins. <laughs> Try the wing cap to grab the coins in the air. <laughs> I've tried oh, once yeah. and I died on the quicksand, so I'm not doing that anymore. <laughs> you can easily down the quicksand there and lose like a minute. But I think I need to catch up at some point, so why not try it now? We should be boss in course 8 now, I think. <laughs> I don't know where we are, but... How many stars do you have? Going for... Uh, I have the wing cap spawned, now I'm going for the... Secrets first, but then... Oh yeah, secrets. <laughs> Not this star, please. I did it again. <laughs> I grabbed the secret without grabbing the coin, the second one. Nice. And yeah, one more time, like we are saying yesterday, uh, we have to, to face Irock. And the, the ants can like sometimes go through the wall and if it happens, uh, you're basically soft lock, you can't beat the boss anymore, so you have to reset the stage, exit course and yeah, because come the, back. This boss is very weirdly programmed, so it can pass through solid walls when it yeah, because you have to goes outside, like goes away, but it can't when it comes back. Yeah, maybe it's because of the way you are supposed to, fast, to face him in Vanilla games. There is no walls where you can go through. So maybe you have trouble to to handle that. English accent, yeah, you know.
Okay, now here, here we go. Jump off like this. I grab them like like this and so uh, I'm too slow now. Okay, I grabbed one coin with the strap. <laughs> it's fine, one coin. <laughs> it's fine, I'm satisfied. But yeah, there's a lot of there's a lot of risk at stake here. So your diet is you have to do the entire 80 coins again, obviously. It's now now time for me to go to toxic wastelands. This, sub yeah, to our base. Like uh, uh, Follow Mamont, yes, this is sub to our base. But we I still have a lot of stuff to do and Omnium, of course. I'm trying to go for the strat again. I got it yesterday. Let's see if I can get it again. So that's like two seconds if I get it. I can skip like the first half of the heave hole thing. Yeah, it looks good. Okay, yeah, I got it again. Uh, I lost a second because of ground pounding too low under the star. Classic. <laughs> Last rice regrets, let's go. Nice. Well. Here we go. Yeah, we are using the wing cap because you can like press A to make you fall down slower. Which makes the star more easier. Yeah, the funny thing is, when I learned this game, I didn't know about that. I didn't know you could just hold A while falling down with wing cap to fall slower. So I learned it the hard way, and now I cannot do it the easy way anymore. I always miss it when I go for the easy way. I will use here a very cool trick. You guys probably know it. Know it. Yeah, saving quit is broken. You can do this. If you haven't quit, it just soft lock the game. Let's die. Yep. Okay. And even if we could save and quit, we have to reset because of Koopa in course 13. I've no idea I just died there. I think I was like the most careful possible. Because if we are not resetting the game, Koopa will just jump off the the platform and we cannot do the, the race, so we have to reset. Just to let you know, when I just try to do these strats, I do a very bad attempt with Total Mario and save 10 seconds on it with a bad attempt. So yeah, I've done the Turtle Mario thing in Course 3 for the secrets in water. 
I really like these threats. Uh, this star is very boring as well, red coins in core 3 and very long as well Although not as boring as star number 1 That's true, but it's way way, way better with Turtle Mario Because well, you are swimming very very fast I've never implemented that yet <laughs> It saves a lot of time Maybe like 15 seconds if you do the strat very well and try to use the speed to go to the star quicker than I'm used to do. Bye guy, please. What's he doing? Hello? It will be very hard to get a world record, considering the time uh, we lost at the beginning. We both have... ...mistakes, so... Yeah. I lost a minute on... ledge grabbing star. Like, mistakes like this, for example. The one I just made right now. But the PB is definitely possible, at least for me. I don't know for you. Considering the run you have. Currently 45 seconds behind, so like 150 pace. Still fine. I mean, that's not saying much because course 15 can destroy everything. So. True. That's why the estimate is so high. Okay, that worked today. Yeah. Slightly faster way to do the star. But it's also very dangerous. You basically have to clip into the heave a little bit. Hope it doesn't trigger. Also, it's half blind because you cannot see. Camera is not adjusted in a good way here. It's fine. Very good movement there. Yeah. 
64 stars, time for me to do the bomb clip now. This is first try. something up there yeah I, we have to do like course one later because of wing cap but yeah Ludwig is doing course one earlier than me yeah Darkman op optimized a little bit here but sadly I didn't have like the time yet to implement it I have actually tried to do to try to do the better route. I don't know if this is the fastest one, so that's why I, I have to do comparison to see which one will be the fastest one. Maybe doing like a part of World 3 first could be very, very fast as well. So, yeah, that's like... what I'm doing. That's like the old strat. Well, the, the so I have to test a lot of things. So if we got every single coin out of the stage, we need to kill two Scuttlebox. And we have our 80. So this course has the longest star. That's not a 80, 80 coin star. Star 6 is every copy is personalized. It's kind of the, the only meme star in the game. It's also the only star I had to look up when I first played this. <laughs> just couldn't find it. I find this one just because... I had I... no idea you can just clip through the, through the cage there. <laughs> I never tried it. I just found it because I went to the top. Because for me it was maybe... Obvious there was something at the top, but yeah. Come on, Maya. Yo, Red Slim. What's up? Red Slim is the world record holder for both categories now, 80 star and 116. True. Now in this very bright white cave here we find the overlord of everything. You might be able to see who it is. I guess Grand Starla likes Kirby a lot.
My god, I almost get a double star spawn by accident. That would be a cool accident. Which yeah. even saves time. Oh, what? Okay. Never mind. <laughs> Okay, course one done, it's time for course 11. Yeah, I just completed it, and on the next one, which is Brigitte Diamond Haven. I did this course yesterday with all the stars, but the 80 coins. You see why, because to go around the entire map basically just to collect enough coins even with 80s it's just way too slow on the 80 star out but the rest is pretty good time was I think I will go for just one attempt at the BLJ in Scary Shroom Peak. Oh nice, I won't try that. I will try it one time. It's way too inconsistent at it, to uh, just keep trying and lose like 10 minutes is not worth it. True. I'm only doing it because I died at the star yesterday as well. when I was doing it the normal way. Can you just grab the I'm doing this part of the third overworld. Because the left stuff to do in the other ones. Just resetting at a very different bot here than Darkman does. Mostly because I still have no idea what star exactly causes the second Cooper to glitch out. Yeah, I don't know neither. So I reset after 80 stars, it's somewhere there. You, you reset at like 50 something or 40 something, so uh, it's probably somewhere in the first or second overworld. Then. After across 8, like in. Like, like we do in 80 stars. Oh, nice, I forgot for I got something, of course. For the star, you can go for a really risky strat. You can just skip the entirety of the path here to this to this wall kick section, um, but it's incredibly difficult to get it. And if you get slowed down by anything during your, your flight under the cone, or under the pyramid here, you just die. Yeah, 
Yeah, let's go for the BLJ one time. Yeah, I got a let's scrap here. Mario Cam. Zoom out. Why did I gold that with a very bad Okay. I got the like fake grab or whatever. I just got my AD uh, coin star fine. with a very bad execution, so I don't know how it's possible, but yeah, why not? Oh, ho, 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 ho. I overshot the star by like one pixel or something. At least it looked like it. That's close, but that that, that was my attempt. I won't sacrifice any more time to this. I mean, so what kind? Thank you, Captain. Yeah. As. <laughs> yeah, this BLJ is definitely the intended play. Uh, we also tried to get the BLJ to the big mushroom there, but it seems that all of these little mushrooms we can BLJ on are all a little bit too low in height, so. The best I was able to get on this big mushroom was a fake ledge grab. But also only one single time. Maybe a task could probably do it, I don't know. Nice job. Why can't I just do the strats here? I just look like 25 seconds from nothing. Why not? That sounds familiar. Stage 11 is, the, is done for me. Time for stage 10. Suspicious coin didn't troll me like yesterday. 
You mean the Sess coin, Mongus? Yes, sometimes you can collect the coin, which is covering up the star there, and you can collect the coin, but not the star. It always feels very... This coin is the imposter, I think. That ledge grab looks very weird with a long jump, it should not be possible, but Darkman explained this yesterday to you, this wall is not really a wall. <laughs> yeah. It has some very weird properties to it, where Mario gets like, teleported all over the place. Well, the people would just, like, uh, follow the zero A process challenges. This is what happened when they grabbed the ledge to go to the secret aquarium. Ah, yeah. Like the new method uh, viable in Nintendo 64 because the first one was VC only. Because it uses parallel universes which crash on console in the, in the castle because you can't fix the camera. So this is like a glitchy that rub. And now we do the last stage of Overworld 3 before I do the reset. And still do Sunset Paradise. This course 14. I always talk to the pop bomb first because otherwise I will forget about it. And then we'll lose tons of time when I realize hey, the cannon is not open yet. It happened before in runs. There is like two types of different glitchy ledge grab mechanics in the game. This is one case, and there is other cases when another type of glitchy ledge grab can happen. The one where ledge grab don't happen, that's true. Here we go. It's time for Switch 12 for me. I won't do the BLG because I just haven't tried it yet. So I'm doing to do like the regular strat. Even with the strat I will use is not basic but still good to do. And these snuffets can be on a very weird cycle. 
for near perfection to Okay, I will not do this route for this one anymore. I don't know why I can do this now. I just can't do this route. For a kind of a difficult start, at least, at least the way I want to play it. Although I make it difficult. The red coins in this stage are kind of dumb. Because they are just off floating in midair here, so you have to use the wing cap. And very hard to see as well because of and the It's background. very hard to see them because of all of this red Bowser and the Farsi background we have. It's easy to miss one of it. Oh, I need one of those. Collect the rest of these Goombas later. We can't do this without using the cannon. It makes you very fast, and when you go fast with a wing cap, yeah, you lose a lot of control. I'm just the second one already. Yeah, I can still make it if I can get it now with one wing cap cycle. I think I got it for the first one cycle. There's a 10 coin box inside there. I don't want to open it. Because this game can actually crash when you open 10 coin boxes. Probably because of the way it works when like 10 of the coins with this skin. I never got that issue, so I don't know. I had the game, I had the game crash twice. I had this on this 10 coin box and one time the 10 coin box on uh, Green toxin wasteland can be something related to plugin, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, my game needs a long time to reset here. Now, reset the game to make way for the Cooper race later. Now, I start with the overworld one again. With the most boring star in the game, so enjoy watching. <laughs> Here we go. 
think Dark Man did this faster. We really need to learn this strat. <laughs> this strat is very cool. Is it hard to learn, you think? Uh, just, it, it can be hard to swim with the shell. Otherwise, it's fine. So, the glitch with the shell is actually easy to get. You just have to bonk on a... Yeah, you, you can bonk like everywhere, but it's very easy to, to know where to bonk. You can show me later if you have time. Yeah, yeah, sure. Ashgrab, please. Yeah, the OB shell glitch. Yeah, the, you know, the Turtle Mario stuff. When you can just swim at the speed of sound. Go places to go, go to follow my rainbow. Nice flag. That's that's how, that's how the French flag looks. That's weird. Yeah, we just use the letter because color are just overrated, you know. Here we go. I accidentally pushed a button there that I didn't want to push. Oh, that's bad, that's bad. I really need the shell. Your friends <laughs> is the wrong, the wrong flag. Oh my god. Even more from wrong flags. Friends, well, but it has, be, it has to be improv strats now. <laughs> this is a new challenge. Front, friends, but only show wrong flags. Wrong flags only. Okay, I will do this 80 coins to completely disordered now. <laughs> Germany, but still not the good flag. <laughs> Very good, perfect. Of Portugal with the Spain. Let's go. France, yes. Nice flag as well. Here we go. My god. I think I just created monsters with that stupid challenge. <laughs> I don't know how close the race is actually. Probably close still. I think nobody knows because we are so different. Like we will meet again at course 15, I think. <laughs> Maybe in course 13? I'm in course 3 now. Oh, I'm in course 14. I do course 3 and then the rest of course 5 very late. Yeah, they are very different. Yeah, I completely forgot we have different routes. 
Yeah, I'm ahead, but I have a very long start to do in this stage. So, it's probably even. Or maybe you are still a little bit ahead because of reds here. Come on, why this is a dive? Oh my god, if I could see game video game. I cannot make this anymore. Oh god! It started. <laughs> please, game, you can't fool me all day, but please just let me see what I'm doing. Just lost that's one not, minute that's, in that's near not perfection. Too much to ask. Oh, near perfection one? Yeah. Uh, I just you're don't doing know. the long jump still, right? No. <laughs> What? God, I, I accidentally put the shell off when I was at diving area. Oh well. Ah, do not go back, please. Okay. I'm grabbing a couple of fast stars. Because Grand Luna Hall, I only got the 80s yet. That was very stupid. I definitely had now. Okay. Very unusual boss fight here. I died in the reflection too. I didn't expect to just completely overshoot the chair here. the secrets and reds to do and I go in core 13 so like between four and five minutes oh come on video game be reasonable for once. <laughs> Never that before. I hate these boxes. Look this way now. It will be fine for the estimate. We have we have like probably enough try for Omnium. I say that now. Omnium is brutal. Yeah. Yeah. For for people who are not aware, Omnium is a four minutes long star and a very hard one. If you die, you can lose one or two minutes each time. So that's why we put uh, I estimate just in case we have trouble with the star. Time to go back to overworld 3. Okay, you are ahead then. Cooper's racetrack now. You are ahead. 
but not much, I guess. I have to finish reds. I have three reds out of eight. I just missed very easy one. That is not Overworld 3. Oh my god, I just got into a red sand again. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's the same location. Like, the overworlds are very similar, and I just went to the wrong overworld. See, this is the same stage over there. It's just not red, but palm trees. But come on. You can't confuse, can't confuse with this. No problem. Yeah, as you can see, Koopa is now taking the correct path. Just gonna grab the reds. We didn't reset, hard reset the game. He would just jump right off at the beginning. Instead. It just gets stuck at the death plane. Man, let me grab the reds, please. Can give Koopa here a nice double race if you want it. <gasps> what the fuck? Okay. the last threads. Okay, I got it. Oh, it was red coins in course 14? Yeah, I died once. Oh, damn it. Please don't die. Because the wing cap right now? No, I just make a, a rollout of the platform and died. That was very sad. To see. It's very hard to tell it wasn't the lead because we have very different routes. We will meet again at course 4 15, that's the only thing that is for sure. Yeah, I know some weird, like, hitbox things about Mario. I only need one extra coin from this guy, but... Four is better because then we can spare up to three coins at this coin line that leads up here. Usually I don't get all five. Okay, that's, that's totally fine. Mm. 
That's good. <laughs> So I guess this race will definitely come down to Omnium. <laughs> yeah, probably. Hundred percent. That was that was clear before the race. But... No, Cooper. I don't care about you anymore. Luna Hall, I'm pretty sure I won't. It's that three hours in Gold 15. Well, I lost a lot, ton of time there in Luna Hall. I lost almost a minute because I died twice on the box star again. On the star too. Yeah, okay, I'll do another race, whatever. Didn't mean to press that, but... Here we go. Out of my way, Cooper! God. <laughs> uh, Mario, you are forgetting a red, please? Alright, I'm entering, uh... <laughs> Cost 15 now. Okay, I have to finish the reds, vanish cap and three, and I'm going to course 15 after that. But everything can change right now. Yeah. Nothing can is decided because course 15 is brutal. Can be you, like finishing ahead, or me catching back. What? That was my speed there. Watch me down star one here. This would be embarrassing. As you can see, like uh, there are four trials on the stage, and the layout of the of the trials these are similar to courses we've already visited. This is like the mountain from course twelve. The first was the volcano, which was there in the ice level, like the ice pyramid or whatever.
I actually have to do this, um, one of my least favorite tricks. Give me back what's that scrap here. He would, I thought he would let scrap there. So I didn't stop. Okay, it's time that. for stage 15. Yeah, this stage we just saw, this is the Koopa Racetrack level with much thinner platforms and of course it's all quicksand, so once we do the fell, we're done for. Every one of these edges, yeah, there is one of these flame spitters. Now I activate the last spitter up there because this always gets me. There's a strat where you can just skip it. I don't know if Darkman's going for it. I think he's the one who uh, discovered that. Uh, sorry, I wasn't listening. <laughs> Star 3 here uh, just bypass the last flame spitter. Uh, yeah, but I don't do this anymore because I died every time now. Okay. So, yeah, and you will see why Omnium. Is a terrible star pretty soon with Ludwig. Yeah, you, you, you see us here all doing this, these trials. I'm doing the Blue Paradise now, which is also terrifying. For me, it's maybe one of the e easiest now. Yeah, you're doing it differently. You truly have to show me how you do it because I cannot replicate it yet. <laughs> In fact, it's just like a feeling for me, mainly. Yeah, so we got the four. Tri I got the four trials now, and now it's time for the Omnium Star, where the Roma creator thought it would be a good idea to just combine all these four trials into one star. So all the star locations have been now replaced with two red coins each. So we have to get to the peak of all of these trials again, and also get back to the middle. Yeah, that's the reason why we put an I estimate. It's because of the and this, star. Yeah, and this star is ideally like five minutes or so, but if you die at the end, you lose almost five minutes and have to start again. And if that happens like three, four times, then you lose 20 minutes already. Just... Yeah, you, you can do for the Omnium. You can do the um, 
materials in the order you want, it's just you trying to handle the pressure. But yeah, you are completely free for the for the order. Yeah, this is 80 coins, not 100, but pretty sure it does the this star with Omnium. It's always a stack of two red coins on top of each other, which can also cause problems. Because it can actually happen that you collect one of the red coins, but not the other for some reason. Maybe they are not like exactly at the same place. Okay, I have to redo this one. No problem. As soon as I realize it, for some reason, yeah, these windows you cannot bounce on them. Lava bounce. Okay, this is not lava. Yeah, the windows are not lava, so if you bounce on them, you just fall down. Okay. Oh okay. yeah, true. Yeah, okay, that's much better. That's why also we can the the egg icon star just doesn't pop off in one frame with the blue switch. Yeah, well, my last try now. If I die now, Darkwind's in the lead, just saying. <laughs> you died? No, if I die in the lead, I'm on my last try now, I'm on the, the race with the shell. I died Which once. Which usually is my most consistent one, but... I died once in... Uh, after getting two reds, so it wasn't that bad to die after that. I only died once so far on my first attempt at star number two. Right at the beginning, too. I spawned the star, but I still have to make, make my way back here. Carefully turn this thing around. Jump off like this. Okay, I made it. That's Omnium. Done. Oh, what the fuck, that was fucking scary, sorry. Sorry for the bad word. Alright, one more star from this course. Uh, the star only spawns. I'm not sure, does it spawn after Omnium? I think. It no, it's spawn. already there in some fight. So when, when Omnium is available, basically. Yeah. One is very easy to get, but yesterday I. Uh, yesterday, no, last time I attempted it, I died on it. Uh, 
That's just the last star here. The Duckman has a last chance to catch up now. Uh, because a Bowser fight can also go really bad. <laughs> As we saw yesterday. Can also lose a lot of time on it. Try. Nice. I'm glad we got the uh, Omnium Star without too much trouble, to be honest. Yeah. I struggled a lot on blue on the blue paradise part. I had I to retry this two times, but I was always able to at least save myself from death. Yeah, I got it. First try. Okay, I'm about to fight now. See how bad this goes today. I think that's not good. We will fall down. Or no. Wow. Okay, that was a very optimal boss of fight here. Wow, that's the goal of the day for me. That's not time, by the way. There's only one star left. <laughs> yeah, and time will happen when you touch the last star. Yeah, time is on touching the last star, and uh, this is just a kind of a bonus level here. This is the first ever attempt of Grand Star of creating something with the ROM hack editor. For our very first attempt, I think it doesn't look, does look pretty good. That's a very simple star here, just 8 red coins, 4 scattered on the ground, 4 we need to win cap 4, and then a bit of climbing here. That's it. Okay, it's time for the fight. Luck. Thank you. And that was like a perfect time. GG. That was like almost a perfect fight. Yeah, the perfect fight too. Like the, these Bowser fights were both really, really, really good. Okay, one more star for me. GG will do big for the win. Thank you. Yeah, this was like around about five minutes over my PB. The GG's guys. Uh, 
I think with your route changes you could have easily like bopped me if you didn't do that mistake in the uh, Omnium, I guess. I don't know, I just lost like 40 seconds. Because I, I died after the red one. Which is one the quick one of the quickest. Okay. You can save up to two takeoffs. I don't know if this uh, is really faster. Yeah, I don't know. Because <laughs> of course you go a little bit and slower than the other. And PB. Ah, nice, nice PB. But how much? Four and four minutes and ten seconds. Four minutes PB. Oh wow. Yeah, sub two. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I guess way better Omnium. Yeah, but uh, Omnium like saved me only two for the four minutes. Well, hope you guys had fun watching, even though you saw this game yesterday already. <laughs> and I say thank you everybody for having us. Yeah, thank you for all the good luck and every people asking questions and everything like that. Also big congrats on the uh, SM64 ROM hack community as a whole and also the guys who make up this or who, yeah, true. who organize these events. And Doing a re always putting up a really good show here. And if you want to learn this hack you can ask both Ludwig and me we can give you Russell's and stuff like that to help you learning the game and yeah we yeah. even have a discord open for this game yeah true <laughs> but yeah if you want to learn this game this is very easy game to learn to be honest so 